What is up guys, Zach here, and I decided to do a post comp for a Hunger Games I recorded. Um, I, I had really poor commentating over this game, so I thought, why not just commentate over it in Vegas? So if my mic quality doesn't sound as good as it usually does, I'm sorry. Um, I didn't get to mess, I can't mess with the mic quality uh, in Vegas just because I don't know how. Um, so right now I'm just getting set ready for the um, people that are about to come. So uh, I'm mining right now to get my stone swords, and then I come up here, and then uh, behind me, some guy hits me, and I have no clue what's going on, so I turn around, and I see two doges, and I'm like, what the f- So then I uh, duel one of them, and it confused me, because uh, I got two doges attacking me, so it was kind of confusing. And then after that, after a few seconds, the other doge TP'd up there, so I ended up getting 2 v one in the- uh, uh, gladiator arena which does not make sense to me as you can see my pvp skills suck right now but i pulled through with two hearts and if you look in chat you can see the guy died from fall damage and i have no clue how he got up there um he was the ninja kit and uh i thought that they patched that but i guess not so um right now i'm just looting trying to get as much soup as i can and i go around this ravine and i see another guy so um, I get my gladiator out and I duel him just for the fact I don't want to get hit in the ravine. So we start batting it out and his name is Zack the Fish I think. And yeah so he didn't have any soup sadly so it was a really easy fight. So um, I just took some food and uh, once I was satisfied with what I got I decided to move on to the next victim. So I went up the hill and I see uh, Bitch Lord and oh my. Uh, this guy the only reason he got Shrek is because he has a pumpkin on. Uh, in the beginning, I get kind of shrekt right now, but, uh, like, I'm sure he could have done a lot better if he didn't have that pumpkin on his head. So, then, um, uh, I give the zombie the stain, and, uh, <laughs> uh, I run to the next guy, and I believe the next guy's in, yep, the next guy's in a ravine, so I try to, as I'm following, duel him, but I missed. So, uh, then the Batman sees me, gives me the death glares, and I hit him once again with it. Now we're in the dome. So, uh, now we just run at each other, and, uh, this guy did not have any soup, sadly, uh, so he died again. So, once again, I just go through the loop, but I don't think I took any of it, just because he didn't have anything worth taking. So, I build out of the ravine, and I run over to the next guy, and I can see he's a diamond sword, and I'm freaking out right now. Uh, my PvP skills weren't that good, because I was really panicking in this fight. Uh, I probably shouldn't have dueled him, probably should just hit him in the ravine, but, uh, whatever. So we're battling it out, I'm not doing that bad, and I, right now I think I'm gonna die. Like, I I have no soup, he's turning around to refill, and I get the last hit on him with half of a heart. I definitely shouldn't have won that, but I did, I got lucky, and he even had an iron sword as a backup, which is just crazy. So, um, now I just go for Benzin, or whatever his name is, I can't really see on a small window preview. So then I see the other guy, and this guy wrecks me. Um, he should have won, but if I had the diamond sword advantage, but if I didn't, he would have beat me. So we're battling it out here, and uh, I think I, um, as he goes to refill, I go to refill after, and then I TP him in, into the arena so that way I can get some resistance and time to refill. So uh, yeah, I just run at him. We're fighting, and I. I believe I kill him. Well, obviously I kill him, but I don't really think that it was by a long shot. So, um, I barely killed him. He would have won if it was a fair fight, but um, I got lucky and I killed the Diamond Sword guy. So, right here I'm just going through the loot trying to get what I want. And then I recraft my soup and I go for the next guy. Um, I kill this chicken. I kill that sheep. Um, and I think this guy's mining and I have to mine down for him. Uh, yeah, there's his name. So I just go down here, and uh, I see him. So I just kind of do some parkour to get down to him without taking uh, a ton of fall damage. Uh, and sadly, I don't believe this guy had soup either, so it was kind of an easy fight. Uh, I duel him anyways, and he's so confused right now. He turns around trying to mine out. I laughed really hard, but uh, yeah, he just died. And I just get his loot until I'm satisfied, and I build up out of the uh, ravine once again. And then I go for the next guy, and I don't think this guy is soup either, which was really upsetting. This game was really easy, but uh, there were some good fights in the end.
Okay, so I'm running a decent amount to get to this person. Um, recrafting from the fall damage and stuff. And I have no clue where this person is. I, I think it takes me a few minutes just to find out where they are. Uh, which is why I sped it up, of course. And just because I can't commentate over a whole game. So I that zombie scared me. I thought it was the actual person. And I can't find them. So I finally found their name. Start mining down to them. And uh, uh, right now I'm kind of scared. I think that they're setting up a trap. But then once I break that last block... Um, I have a feeling that, you know, this isn't a trap. This should be pretty easy. And they get a few hits on me, so then I try, I duel them. And they run straight at me, they know what's going on. And I thought that they were going to kill me, but they didn't have any soup. So I took their chest plate, and I built up out of the hole at once I was done getting the loot that I wanted. So I built up, and uh, now I'm back on Galand. I'm moving around in circles. But uh, now I'm back on land and I'm going for PC Builder. Which, and then I find that chicken and uh, I, I run into a bit of mob issues as you just saw. And uh, I find out this guy is um, mining as well. So, so I assume that he's not going to have any soup. So as you saw, I was about to run away. But I thought, you know, why not? He's not that far away. So I mined down to him. And once again, I thought this was going to be another trap, or A, or B, he was going to have no soup. And I was right, he had no soup, he got two hit. So, um, he didn't really have anything I wanted besides an iron sword repair, even though I already had a full durability one. I probably should have taken the iron and smelted it and made some pants, but whatever. So after looking through all of the loot, I just took three buckets from what I remember and repaired my chest plate. And then I, uh, I built out, out, I built up back to the surface. And uh, I looked at the feast coordinates. And I was about to go to them, but I thought, you know, I still have a few minutes. Why not go for this other guy? So, uh, on my way to the other guy, it announces the feast once again. And I'm thinking I should go, but it's pretty far away. So, I decided I should go for the guy I'm tracking first. So, um, I'm getting really close to him now. And, uh... Now it's back in real motion, and I realize that he's mining again, and I'm not about to go mining down there with only two minutes remaining. So I decide I'm just going to go to the feast now. Um, that guy's probably going to die anyway, so let's just go to the feast. So uh, I get my I fill up my water buckets, well, my buckets that become water buckets, and then I find a feast here. So um, I thought I'm going to mine out through the middle, but then I realized you can't, so I made a staircase here. Um, well, I'm trying to, but I'm too close. And then a full iron comes down and scares the crap out of me. Uh, I literally screamed when this happened. And then uh, I'm about to duel him, but then he had... Uh, he just forgot the soup or something. So I'm panicking right now. I'm throwing out everything, trying to get the iron. And I shift-click the ar armor on. And uh, this part should be... Yep, this part sped up. Because I take ages tr going through the feast and uh, getting what I want. So I get a sharpness one, my diamond sword, which is great. And then I get full diamond and a few uh, instant damage pots and three ender pearls from what I remember. I mine the enchantment table, throw out all the junk that I don't want, and I go through the chest again to get some more food and just make sure I didn't forget anything. I take the poison pot and stuff. <coughs> so I place the TNT, I explode the feast so that way no one else can get the loot that I did not take. And uh, I don't look at explosions because cool guys don't look at explosions. So then I just, uh, I placed all the TNT because I was about to explode it right there and then, but then I realized I probably should save it. So I did save it. I did some recrafting and uh, inventory organization. So I throw out my spare compasses, recraft, and I go for the, uh, the other remaining people. So I start running back, and I think that these two people are teamed. And I thought that they're in the midst of those glitched people, but I guess not. So I continue to keep running after them, and uh, we run into a sand biome, and I see a temple, and then uh, I see both of them, and uh, they're obviously teaming. So I get my lava bucket out, because they don't see me yet, and mines and damage pots. I was going to pot spam them, but I didn't want to. So I placed lava inside of them, and uh, that guy didn't even notice for a few seconds. I was going to um, use my gladiator ability to 1v1 them, but I didn't want to just to make it more entertaining. So as you see, it's slow-mo right now, and I just pot-spammed him. I thought that was pretty funny. So 
Uh, then me and this guy continue to battle it out. I say GG early in the fight, which I probably shouldn't have. Uh, kind of rude, but um, just, I don't know, I had a really good feeling I was going to beat this guy in 1v1. So this guy's getting destroyed. Seems like he's kind of lagging a bit. So since he's running away, I challenge him in a 1v1. Uh, and I wanted to see if lava would work here. So I'm just about to place lava just to see if lava actually does work, and he dies. So, um, that's basically the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed that. And if you guys want the pack that I used in this video, let me know. Because at 800 subs, I was thinking about releasing it. So, um, I hope you guys enjoyed that, guys. See ya.